And you're back with Radio Big. And now for today's weather. Once again, it seems our slopes are to be graced with some picture-perfect conditions. And after last night's exceptionally heavy snowfall, a few feet of the fresh stuff to boot. It's funny how that always seems to happen. The SSX competitor spotlight continues with Brit sensation Moby Jones. This dreadlocked master of the slopes is back to show his stuff on this year's SSX circuit. Although the level of competition is at an all-time high, Moby shows no signs of letting his fans down. Let's check in with our latest competitor spotlight. Canadian powerhouse Elise Riggs is back with the SSX circuit. Seems she's already on the way to making sure the veterans and newcomers alike are fully aware of her riding talents. Here's the latest in our competitor spotlight. Mac Fraser seems to be having the time of his life up here. Mac is enjoying some serious wins on the circuit, spinning up a storm at Day Shack, and getting some wicked backcountry riding in between events. You can catch Mac doing his thing on any of the three peaks. This competitor spotlight is on Kauri Nishidaki. If you don't know who Kauri is, uh, pull your head out of the snowbank. Okay, stylish from her boots all the way up to her always funky hair, Kaori has become the ultimate celebrity in Japan. It's not hard to figure out why. Check out her riding, and you'll see what I mean. What's happening with our SSX competitors? It looks as though Zoe Payne is back to continue her long-time winning streak. Although competition is fierce on this year's circuit, many are pegging Zoe as a strong contender. This competitor spotlight features returning rider Simon Stark. Why does Simon stand out so much? You know, is it the tattoos? Maybe? The uh, combat-inspired clothes? How about that hair? I like to think that it's his results, probably, you know? Win after win after win after win, medal after medal. The man is unstoppable. See for yourself. <laughs> 